Hey guys, uh, welcome back to SoCal Sense. I'm Jeff. I'm Luke. And today we are joined with the lovely and talented Miss Lexi Ainsworth. Aww. How are you, Lexi? I'm good. How are you guys doing? Doing good. Uh, Lexi is from General Hospital, Emmy Award winning actress. Uh, it's pretty fun. And we're going to have her smell the replica line today. You ready? I'm excited. Let's do it. All right. All right, so the first fragrance we're going to have you smell is at the barber's. This is meant to smell like you're at the barber's. All right. I'm only been to a handful. Let's see. Oh, I actually smell a little bit of aftershave in this. Yeah. 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 And like men's shaving cream. Totally. Would you yeah. find this like attractive on a man? Is it? It smells like, it smells like aftershave. So it smells yeah. like fresh and clean. So do you picture a barber shop? I could picture a barber shop. It just it it smells like you just shaved your face. Yeah. Okay. It's and fresh. would you want to smell it on a guy? Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Out of ten? Mmm, I'd say seven. Seven out of ten. Yeah. Solid. Solid clean. Yeah. Cool. Seven. Fresh out of the shower smell. Yeah. Awesome. yeah. Great. Cool. At the barbers. The next one Lexi is going to smell for us is Sailing Day. Okay. So this is meant to feel like you're sailing on a yacht. I like that. Look, it's very subtle. It's very light. Mm -hmm. I do like it. I feel like I have to apply it a few times. Unless you just want something more... Yeah, it's really simple, fresh. Do you get that ocean vibe with it? I mean, I'm not getting any like... Hmm. No, I'm not getting like salt. I don't know if you can smell salt. Yeah, you can, oh, salt yeah. yeah. I don't really smell the salt, but it is really light. It's fresh. I typically prefer more of a musky smell, so I'm going to give this one a three just because of my own personal preference. Okay. There's nothing wrong with yeah. that. Um, does it smell like a sailing day? Because that's what he's trying to replicate. It smells like a, like a picnic, I think. Okay. Got a clear blue. I, I smell like, I get blue skies. Maybe cool. not water, but... Like a nice clear day. That's cool. Yeah. There we have it. Three out of ten for a sailing day. All right, Lexi. Let us know what you think of jazz club. Ooh. Oh, I like jazz club. Yeah. This is my favorite so far. Uh, it makes me want to have a Negroni. I have no idea. I love Negroni. I have no idea. At least like snotted like we didn't talk um, about. Or like an Americano. It's it's okay. it, it's a uh, like it's spicy, it's sweet. It's yeah, it's so spicy. Can you and picture sweet. sitting in a dark lounge with a jazz musician Definitely. on stage? This one's very on point. Um Yeah, maybe a little bit of cinnamon in there. Um, yeah, it makes, like, a Negroni is like gin, and, um, I think it has Campari in there, and vermouth, so yeah, and, uh, orange zest. Okay, yeah. so out of ten, what would you give this? I'm gonna give it a nine. Give it a nine? nine. Yeah, yeah. Right. it is really sweet, though, so I think you only need, like, one spray, and you're good for the whole day. Yeah, like, cooler weather. For yeah, sure, like it's definitely yeah. a fall scent. Yeah. 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 Awesome. Mm -hmm. Great. Jazz club. This next one that Lexi is going to smell is Whispers in the Library. So shh. Let us know what you think of Whispers in the Library. I'm guessing you're going to, they're invoking like being, I think the, the story is like 1997 and Cambridge Library or something like that. Like old musty books. It is musky with a little bit of spice. I can see this being Whispers in the Library. Oh. I like the title a lot. Um, do you like the smell? I do like the smell. 
it's it's like a younger but sophisticated scent. Mm -hmm. To me, it's really smooth. It is. It's kind of similar to similar notes to Jazz Club, but a little bit more on the feminine side. To me, it smells very similar to Jazz Club minus the tobacco note. Yeah. Because the tobacco makes it a lot stronger in the Jazz Club, and if you don't like tobacco, then Whispers in the Library is a great alternative. I feel like. Yeah, it has a hint of like a little bit of floral more so than the mm -hmm. other one. That's why I think it smells a little bit more feminine. I give this one an 8. An 8 out of 10. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Great. Whispers in the Library. Is this the last of mine? Yeah. Last of, okay. This looks like your favorite. It's the biggest bottle. This is, so I actually have this bottle. This is by the fireplace. And this one has like been my go-to like cold weather kind of fragrance. Okay. But don't let that influence your All right. liking of it. <laughs> Ooh. I do, I smell the tobacco I think the most on this one actually. Okay. More so than Jazz Club. Does it smell like you're burning wood at the fireplace? Yeah. It does. It smells like 1971. Maybe that's with the tobacco. Burnt. It's like a burnt wood. Yeah. yeah. Burning wood and chestnut. Yeah, I do smell that. That's actually pretty on point. I really like this. Yeah. It is a good like fall scent. It's a bit more relaxed than Jazz Club. Okay. This one is it also has, unisex. It has more of like a, like when I smell it, it's more of a calming effect on me than Jazz Club is like more vibrant of a feeling that I mm -hmm. get. But I really, So really, this is like your cozy night in. It's really, Like yeah. log cabin by the fireplace with snow. Yeah, and a cashmere onesie. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, I'm gonna give this one a nine. Nine, nine, okay. all right. Yeah. Awesome, by the fireplace. Nine out of 10. The last one that Lexi is gonna smell is Under the Lemon Tree. Let us know what you think of Under the Lemon Tree. I'm expecting citrus. Yeah. Lemon. Mm-hmm. It smells like a fresh, clean home. Yeah. I could almost use this more so as a room mist than on my body. That is an expensive room mist. <laughs> Not, <laughs> I, get I it. would like it on like fresh linens. Not on me personally. Right. Yeah, the only time I would wear this is like a super hot day outside. It, it, yeah, or that. It's very, very, it's light. It's definitely feminine. Does it feel like you're sitting under a lemon tree? I mean, I'm definitely getting the lemon. Um, the lemon is definitely coming through. Um, yeah, I would just use this more as a room mist, to be honest. So, you wouldn't want to smell it on a guy then? No. Okay. But then. if he had this, like, if I walked into his apartment, so room mist, or on his pillow. If this was a candle, you would be, you would like it then? Yes. Okay. Yes. Scale of one to ten as a fragrance on a guy. As a fragrance on a guy? Two. Two? Maybe and even as, a one. And as a I, room yeah. mist or a candle? Probably an eight. Eight, cool. Yeah. So it smells nice, just not your preference. Exactly. Cool. Under the lemon tree. All right, so we are going to now have Lexi do a speed round. Tell us if she likes the fragrances better, worse, or the same. So really quick. So this is the dry downs, yeah. So it's settled, you ready to go? Yeah, let's do it. All right. Okay, at the barber's. Hmm, it's spicier now. Okay. Um, sorry, this is supposed to be fast. Um, it's all right, you can take your time. I actually maybe like it one point more. more Better? Yeah, Better. I right. like spice. Nice, great. Uh, sailing day. Hmm. Mm. It's worn off because it's a really light smell, so. I'd say it's probably one one lower. Actually. One lower. She didn't like it to begin with, and even less now that she can't smell it. Wah, wah, wah for sailing day. <laughs> All right, now jazz club. 
It got sweeter. I'm gonna keep this one the same. Still a nine? Yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, whispers in the library. Mm. This one got better, actually. Is this a nine? It was an eight. Is it now a nine? It's now a nine. Great. Yeah. Cool. Buy the fireplace. Mmm. It's even, it's smokier now. I like this one the same. Sure. Yeah. So currently we have, oh, there's one more, sorry. Oh. And under the lemon tree. Okay. Still fresh. Still like it as a room mist. Cool. So we have a tie right now. We have Whispers in the Library, which is nine out of 10. We have By the Fireplace and we have Jazz Club. All nines. So I'm gonna let you decide of the three, what's first, second, third. Okay. So whispers. Okay. Okay. By the fireplace. Mm hmm. On a guy or on me? Because I would wear these two. Okay, so let's do guy first. Okay, so on a guy. Hmm. Jazz Club, number one. Okay. By the Fireplace, number two. And Whispers in the Library, number three. And on you? On me, Whispers in the Library, number one. Hmm. By the Fireplace, number two. And Jazz Club, number three. Cool. So, opposite order. Opposite yeah. order, yeah. So, which is funny, because that's pretty much how it would yeah. be, because more feminine, Those are less both feminine. Sex, and this one is actually male. Ah. Yeah. So, That's funny. Perfect. Great. Yeah. Cool. Thanks for joining us today, Lexi. Thanks for having me. Uh, the Mason uh, Margella line is great. It's fun. There's a lot of interesting takes on different fragrances. And yeah, um, be sure to follow us on our socials listed right down below. Uh, tune in on ABC to General Hospital. It's ABC, right? It is. ABC, General Hospital. Check your local listings for the time because I'm sure it's different wherever you live. And... Yeah, that's it. Bye guys.